Hey guys, thanks for stopping by. If you like my video, please like and subscribe. Also check me out on Twitch as Floyd Mason. One day I will have bombs. That will be a grand day. Although if I get two wallets, you know, then Bomb City. Have all the bombs I could ever ask for. That's unfortunate. I can though, I almost always find a song in the bottom of the level. Even when everything else was was garbage, I still found a song. Just people be hiding songs in wells. Yeah. Kind of pumped, like um I use the uh, uh, limited run games. Um, I get some games up there. They have some cool stuff, um, and I like I like physical copies of games, as you can tell by the wall of games over here. Um, but they recently put out one, and it was by I want to say the company's from Wales, and they made a game called the Shape Shifting Detective, uh, which is pretty fun. It's just kind of like a you know, ow. Um, you know, it's like live video, and you can shape shift into the people and, and talk to them, and you're trying to solve, like, a murder. Um, and I quite enjoyed it. It was pretty fun. Um, and so they released a second game, and it's like you're on, like, a spaceship. It's kind of a similar thing with live video, and I was super excited about it. And it sold out instantly. Like, it was just gone. And I was like, well, that's a bummer. But what are you going to do? Um, and they, they actually released another one called Five Dates. And I'm like, eh, not, it doesn't sound as much my style, but... I like the company, I think their games are great, I'm gonna support it, so I grab that one. But like, every other game that they put out recently, they're like, oh, like, second run available, like, more games, but not of that one. Like, why not the space one? Bring back the space one. I want it. I want to buy it. And limited run's like the only way I'll probably be able to do it. It's, it's a bummer. Um, okay, so... We could go and, and do stuff here. Well, actually, no, I can't. I need bombs close by, so we can't do anything here, but it's barren anyways. So, I will take this free time. Stop the drink. Um, I am thinking, speaking of drinking, of doing another retro drinking stream. Um, I'm thinking the weekend after Easter. I just haven't decided what I want to play yet. Um, honestly, in theory, like, you know, I'd like to at some point do Super Nintendo, do Sega maybe, um, you know, maybe maybe some Turbo Graphics games, but I love the original NES. Um, I think the games work really well for it. So I might redo a bunch of games and just, you know, redo challenges I failed or set longer challenges. You know, like, a lot of them were, like, beat the first level. And I might do, like, you know, beat beat two levels, beat three levels, like, beat the whole game, you know? And maybe, you know, if I do a six-hour stream, try and beat, like, three games or something. Um, haven't decided yet. Um, you know, things like things like the Mega Mans are great for that, like, letting people vote and pick somebody. Um, I'll probably put all them in again and just get rid of the, the ones I played, so they're different levels. Honestly, doing, like, full Mega Man streams at some point would be awesome. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I tend to look up what weapon works well against what boss, because I've beat them all already, and I just don't remember. And it's that, like, that frustrating thing where you get there, and then you just hit them with every one until you go, oh, this one hurts. It's great. And then you can do it. And then it's super easy. So, who's got that kind of stuff? I don't. No. Oh, you know what? I have something. What am I doing? Come on, chat. You gotta help me out. You gotta remind me when I'm being an 
I've already told you I'm a big idiot, and I need help. Okay, let's go get Richard. Don't talk to any other dogs. Now, if I'd lost my shield, it wouldn't have mattered. What do you got back here? Ooh, the mirror shield, eh? How much? Ooh, pricey. Pricey. Well, if I have. I get the wallet, I can buy one Triforce piece and a meter shield. So, that's not nothing. Let's sell these hints. Um, actually, quite a bit. For being an hour and 17 minutes in. Um, Ice Cavern, Path of Gold. Awesome. Thanks, game. Um, okay, so Frogs 2 is dead. Sounds also, of course. Get outside again. It's good, because I was going to check that first. Um, great. So, I have to unlock Ice Cavern, which, I mean, I would still need Zelda's Lullaby and the letter to get there. Oh. Let's see. Let's see what the other ones are. He has Fire Temple... And Forest Temple. Cool. I mean, that's that's not a bad breakdown, really. If, like, I would have had to get all six. Like, doing the three kids is not too bad. Um, you know, Spirit and Water, not awful. You know, usually it's... If you have to do Forest, Fire, and... Or, Forest, Spirit, and Shadow. It gets a bit tedious. <clears throat> and if you have to, like, add in Jabu to that. It can be a bit much. Alright. Let's go. Off to Kakariko. It's always weird, like, you feel the desire to go to, to adult early, but, like, honestly, he can't do that much. The kid has so much more stuff available to him, um, because all of the temples for adult Link are inaccessible until you get a couple items. Um, there's not really that much at the lake, there's really nothing in Kikiri, and, and, again, until you get, like, the hook shot, at the very least. Um, no, I don't, do I want to be here at night? Anything in here for the night? No, 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 no. You know, in like the river again, like you could do the stuff as a kid, other than basically his two sculptures. So until you get the um, hook shot, there's not much there. But he's got a pretty good Kakariko, and he can go up to Goron City earlier. That as well. Hey, hey Navi, what is up? <sighs> Again, chat, come on. I'm being an idiot, remind me. I'm so used to like never getting the sun song. That uh, I don't even think about it. I'm just wasting time waiting for the stupid sun. Oh my god. What an idiot. What a dumb idiot. Yeah. Yeah. The thing is, too, I will say is I use a different tracker um, 
because I need the Triforce pieces on it. And so this, the songs don't stand out as much to me. So, like, I looked at the tracker and didn't even realize I had it. Oh, okay, here we go. Here's some stuff. Also, I have memes. So. Um, Alright, so, wallet. Two wallets. We can get that. Okay. If I get one wallet, I can get uh, bomb shoes as well. Which, you know, stand. Ooh, another piece in here. This one gonna be reasonable? No. Crazy light? No. Ugh, okay, well, I mean, guess I'll buy that, guess I'll buy this, not super pumped about it, but, alright, so there's three, if I get a wallet, there's three more pieces right there, so that's kind of nice, um, now I spent all my money, I can't afford archery, so let's, her first. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. If we get it for free, I'll probably use it. Um, but we'll see what's in here. Um, we will see what windmill song is. Stick up three. Nope, just um, we'll see what the windmill song is. Then we will do Dampe's race. Well, you know what? I'll probably do the Sun Song Grade first. I'm gonna guess it's nothing, but because I really feel like sometimes it's not in needed. I don't think bottom of the wall is required. Okay. I actually have the song of time as well, so I can get out of damp damp days. What a time to be alive. Sounds on. We will. Thanks. Bum, bum. Guess I should have just done. <clears throat> I forgot I had that song of time until I was already in the windmill, but that would have been a better use of time. him down here so that he remembers that he failed and I got that chest of arrows. It's just the kind of hero of time I am. I don't know if anyone remembers them, uh, but I packed a Kickstarter this week for the stone protectors. Um, I don't know if it's an old game that they're like re-releasing, but it's like a Sega kind of like 2D beat 'em up. But it also comes with like the DVD of the of the cartoon. And it's just like one of those things that like I forgot about. It. Like I used to watch it with one of my buddies sometimes. And I forgot about it. I probably spent more money than I should have. Because I was just like, when am I ever gonna see this again? I'll forget about this in my life. Uh, and it's just so like out there. Interesting, the, the uh, stone protectors. Do you recall? They were like, they were like uh, trolls, but they had like power stones in their chest, so they had powers, uh, and they were pretty good, as I remember. I'm just waiting for somebody to like, somebody to make something with the street sharks. Like, why are the street sharks not still around? How is that not a thing? How are people not spending millions of dollars to make more street sharks? You don't remember street sharks or stone protectors? Stone protectors, I'll forget. Street sharks, I don't know that I can. <clears throat> um, yeah, I also I have a game coming on Tuesday. <laughs> I bought a Space Invaders game, and it's finally coming. I think I have three or four board games that should be coming soon. Um, I also I got a game a while back, but you actually need an online app to play it. 
and I got the game before Christmas, and they're finally releasing the app next week, so I can play the game I've owned for three months. It's like, thanks. Like, I get it, but the developers were kind of a prick. They made they made three different, like, you could get it for, like, 1900s, 2000s, or, like, 2100s or some, some crap like that. And the first one sold really well, like the the early one, and they got an order to put it in like stores. So they rushed out all of those ones plus the app and kind of left the rest of us waiting, which I think is a huge dick move. Like, I fucking prepaid for your game. Maybe I'm more important than stores. I get from a business model, yeah, stores, but... I don't know. I was watching a video, or a couple of videos yesterday, of, like, failed Kickstarters and, like, people who didn't get the stuff and, like, you know, like, I don't know how much it costs to make a game, but people getting, like, a hundred thousand dollars and they're unable to, like, produce, um, a video game they promised, and it's like, hmm, that, that sucks. <clears throat> You know, just... And so I was like, oh, like... Somebody took part of the money, or like, this or that happened. I'm like, still, like, that sucks. You put a couple hundred towards a game, and the developers just go, well, the money's gone, and we didn't finish it. I'm like, great, finish it. Like, I don't care. Go get a go get a real job, and work on it in your nights. Like, where's my game? I think Kickstarter should be a binding agreement. It just makes me think of the um, um, the Seinfeld episode with the layers, where they make a bet that uh, Kramer won't do it, and then he doesn't, and like Jerry's like, okay, like you owe me money. He's like, no, no, but I didn't, I didn't not do it. I don't want to do it now, and like Jerry's like, yeah, that's the bet. The bet is whether they would get built or not. And he's like, yeah, but I don't want them anymore. So <clears throat> that's what Kickstarter reminds me. Of. People are just like, well. I took your money saying I could do it, and then I spent the money, so now I don't have money to do it. It's like, right, but all it is is your labor, so put your labor in there. Get it in there. Get me my game. Ah, that sucks. Don't need that. Um, okay, so I have arrows at least so I can stop Link. Or, sorry, Link's cool name. Oh, I'm trying to remember. We just, uh, we just finished watching... Um, New Girl this week. I'm trying to remember what the name of, of Winston's kid is. Because it is hilarious. It's like Dan Bob or something like that. It's like two names jammed together. It's really funny. I have shield. You know I got shield. I just don't choose to use it. I got it recently. I just got it uh, from Anju. <clears throat> but I don't need the crutch stab, you know? I have I have faith in my Oh yeah, okay. Tell me about the dragons. Tell me about the Gorons. Yeah. So I don't have bombs, so I can't do the top room. I do have I don't have money right now, but I do have the Song of Time. So I could get across the lava. Let's see what's in the store first. Do, 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 do. Ooh, another tri There's like one Triforce piece in every store. Oh, I can actually afford this one. Well, well, well. Let's get some cash. I haven't got one in a while. <clears throat> so we'll get some cash. We'll buy that Triforce piece. Then we'll get some more cash. And we'll try to go up and get the... Uh, <clears throat> the... Uh, uh, what should we call it? <clears throat> Man, I'm gonna have like no time in here. I have no life. How much time does this give me? It's just 30 seconds. Can I even get up the ladder in 30 seconds? I don't think I can. I better stay out of there. It was nice that I got all those Triforce pieces at the start, but now I have no items. But again, I know where magic is. I know where four Triforce pieces are. I know, I know where, um, bombs are. I know where, 
bomb shoes if I could get bomb shoes. Um, they're cheaper. What else do I know? Running boots. Um, I feel like there's one other thing in the store I still can get. I know where Bolero is, but it's not super necessary. Let's get that. Go. To eleven. Do, 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 do. Wait, I kind of want to go. I don't want to try and make it through here. Even with 30 seconds, I might. If I die, I die. But I mean, there's not really much up there. Like, you know, I, can't, I can't do the grotto because I don't have bombs. I could maybe get the heart piece inside the wall. I'll definitely die doing it, but I could. Um, but then, like, what else do I do? I mean, there's not. Any sense going to the lake with what I had? There's nothing really in the forest. Like, is it back to kid already? Even the only Goron tunic I saw was 200 rupees, and it was as a kid, and it won't let you buy it as a kid. So, if it's on the right. There we go. Right. Maybe I'll get a big item in here. Um, I can also go. Oh, that's nice. Like that. Um. I can also go down and do archery in Kakariko. Um, ooh! Don't need him! Thanks, game! Good temp. We have light arrows. Ow. Um, okay. So, a lot of garbage. <laughs> Please get out. Oh, okay. Phew. Alright. So we can at least get the item in the wall. Hopefully it's something good. I'm gonna die again. I wanna see what that item is, but I don't have the time. And it's nothing. We are at 19, so... Anyone see what that is? Oh, it's a piece of the Triforce. Come on. Come on, game. That means that two wallets are probably in logic, because I need two wallets to get Bolero. <clears throat> Big weapon early, but what has the run done for me lately? So I'm cooking, how's the pace? Uh, I got a lot of Triforce's uh, piece early, but uh, it's really falling apart. But there's 
four in stores to buy. So if I find a wallet, I instantly have 15. Um, I know Ice Caverns way of gold, so there's probably two in there. Um, I know one's there if I get two wallets, so in theory, I know where about six, seven are. But it's... Where do you go next? I'm gonna do that checking. No! No, I've tried to do it, and I couldn't figure out the angle. I'm, I've meant to, like, watch a video because I swear I saw somebody do it. Not that I have hovers to do it anyways, um, but... Um, okay, so... There's not... Is there anything worth doing as an adult because like if I go down to the lake I don't have the hookshot or iron boots so I can't really do anything there I can't get into Gerudo Valley yet there's nothing for him yeah I gotta go kid got a kid um, and go back to back to the forest <clears throat> Because I can do Ocarina Memory Game, I can do the Song of Storm checks, and go to the Sacred Metal Forest. Wow, look at you, look at you guys, making friends. Oh, I can do the um, Soft Soil checks as well. And he is almost had a almost had a PB today. He is. Uh, I was actually. I can't remember if you were in the room when I was talking about this, Darth. Um, I was talking about it earlier in the week, but the problem is, I think too, is like looking at the Felix Felix runs. Um, I think that top five is possible. A top five time is possible. You need to be 2404. But I don't think there's room for both of us to be in the top five. So one of us is going to eventually edge out the other. And I'm really worried that you're going to keep me out of the top five. And like, congrats if you do it. I mean, you know, I'll be happy for you. But uh, I think you're going to keep me out of that top five. Because I can, I can, I feel like I can get below 2404. I don't think I can get down to 23. Which is, uh, fourth place has 23, so. so. That is a bummer. start moving to games with low low runner percentage and uh, get some get some top five times because there's only three people running I feel good about myself it's my it's my plan well, I, I can't see me ever running anything other than NES games um, and like as soon as I see a game where people are kind of like doing glitchy stuff to get through I just I'm not good at that stuff I find it super interesting I'm not good forgot about that. If I beat, um, oh, I never checked those adults, what, uh, where the temples are, but if I beat two temples and get to Burning Cack, I get a Triforce piece. Uh, oh, and Zelda throws one, so one's locked behind uh, Forest and Fire? Come on. It's too much. The game is, the game is having a laugh. I'm sorry, son. Oh, but I do have soft soil. Let's go this way. No! Game, come on. Why gotta be? Why gotta be like that? Oh, 
just from we're taking this. Oh, now I have to leave one soft soil out here. What a pain in the ass. Uh... Almost forget it for a sec. Is this thing is like Felix where I have to count out how many times I've hit a boss. Wow, three Deku nuts in a row? Get get out of here. Almost swore again. I'm trying not to swear too much. Um, in my streams. Just Just in case my nephew is watching. Or my nieces. Try and limit it. Sometimes you can't help it, sometimes it slips out. But I do my best. Keep it very PG. Put a seed in here just in case I ever come back out here. Um, but we're gonna go to Sacred Mineral Forest and um, check the Storm's Grotto. And then I guess down to the lake again, because I could get the two boomerang sculptures on the way. I don't really know what else to do. I feel like I really need to find um, the letter, Ruchu's letter. is a big item. I feel like I gotta get into ice caverns. What's gonna be boring is once I find a wallet too, I literally have to go to every store. Settings request, random music. Yeah, I can do that next time. Absolutely. Um, I, did, I think I did like once in a practice one. And it was just kind of like, because I hadn't played it in so long, it, was, it threw me off, and so I've never like looked at that page again, but I think it, I think that'd be fun. Oops, that's not the right song. Again, I gotta get up to that, um, uh, too bad, nope, it's too late, it's already been requested, so it will be happening next time. It is a little weird at first, but like honestly, I've played the game so many times, I like barely hear the music anymore. Like, like subconsciously you do, but. There you go. Spirit Temple Key? Not helpful. Yeah, I guess down to the lake. Oh man, so much party time. Um. Yeah, that, that's the kind of thing again, too, like, I want to get the point systems because then I can be like, oh, like, suggest a game to play, um, things like that. Um, I liked one that, uh, uh, he was lurking here before, but uh, Floppy Bacon, who does speedrunning in Link to the Past, was doing a, a like, um, fan-made game the other day, and he used the Hydrate, but it was Take a Drink, which would be great for my drinking streams. Um, graveyard path of gold. Did I get anything in graveyard yet? No, that I got anything in the graveyard. Because I've already done most of it. Um, well, let's go down to the lake. Um.
but yeah, like some of the things I'm going to put in there are like suggest the next game, um, suggest settings for Ocarina, like next randomizer run, um, you know, give me a drink. Um, I'm also probably going to make a fun, because um, you can make your own like uh, little, little guys to post, um, but I'll probably make one of both me and Winnie chilling out like we do. I mean, like, what else is there in Graveyard? So I've done Soft Soil, I did Dampay's Digging, I did Dampay's Race, I know the Crate's Empty, um, I did the Sun Song Grave, I did Shield Grave, like, it has to be. I don't think I've gotten a piece of gold in there yet. So, I think you're right, but I think that's the only thing left. So I can't really, you know, give you too much credit. Oh man, you might, I wonder your opinion on this, Noel, but I was watching a video, er, yesterday, I think it was, and it was a guy talking about, like, the statistics of how to win Guess Who all the time. So I was, like, pretty interested. I'm like, oh, did he find, like, a statistic way to, like, guess and stuff? Um, you know, he's kind of talking about how, like, it's best to, you know, if you have a question that deletes half the people, let, that's the best question, because over time, like, you will have aver average lower guesses, you know, like you eliminate, take a random shot at like, it might eliminate five or it might eliminate 25, but he's like, you know, he's like showing like, oh, like if you eliminate half, like that's the best statistic in the gift, great. But then he got to his questions and he showed that like every question you can ask and guess who eliminates five people of the 30. Um, but his way of doing that was like, do they have glasses or black hair or they're a woman? And I'm like, that's... I mean, like, technically that's within the rules, but, like, that's not statistics. That's just, like, being a dick. It, yeah, exactly. Like, it, it, like, started off statistically, like, okay, yeah, yeah, absolutely, yeah. You want to you wanna cut it in half each time. Like, that's definitely the best way. Oh, you're just asking three things at once. But, like, like... It feels like cheat. I, I know it's not cheating, but I think if someone did that to me, I'd stop playing with them. It didn't feel statistically fair. Like, yes, you're asking a question that cuts it into uh, into half, but I don't know. Yeah, those questions are pretty cool. Um, uh, my my brother and sister in law also like they built one of those like guess who boards that's like family and friends um and that's a fun one to do and like not ask questions like like that and be like oh like if you ask this person like would they would they give you a a piggyback ride like if pressed could this person eat an entire chicken by themselves like that's that's a funner way to play play guess who i think Kind of a disappointing trip back to the farm. Man, I'm actually running out of places to go. Yeah, it's a lot funner. Like, it's the kind of thing that I wish we had, like, thought of in, like, university. That would have been a fun game. Although I don't think, collectively, we would have all known the same 30 people. Because I knew, like, you five. And that's it. And that's all I talked to. And everyone else I kind of knew through you. Ish. I knew, like, their names. If you're like, oh, they're interested in this, I'm like, I don't know. If you say so. I guess I knew Jay, too. I knew six people. Yeah, I knew, yeah, and Jay. But, like, I mean, again, like, me and, like, I knew Jay for the one year we lived together. And then we didn't really hang out again for like two years because he moved like he, he graduated the year before us um, and then the first year I was in Toronto we didn't really hang out too much and then we just started like like it was like alright we're both in Toronto like we should get together and have some beers and then we like 
and start hanging all the time again. But, you know, it's weird. It's, and, like, you don't see people for, like, a year, and it kind of, like, it's... You don't... You fall kind of out of that groove of hanging out. Um, I mean, I know her. Could I answer, like, questions about, like, things she likes? Somewhat. There's a piece of Triforce. I mean, I remember that she likes Lord of the Rings. Um... She was... Oh, I should've got a... Damn, I should've got a stupid bug before I came out here. Um, that was like half the reason I came out here. Um, you know, her and Shannon, I feel, were both in like art majors with math minors. Shame you couldn't have met Noel in university, so I could have had like a good influence in my life. Because, like, Jay and Slack were not good influences. They were like, drink all the time, do whatever you want. Yep. Yeah, all true. That's... Those are facts. Um, I know I know that she's she's pregnant now. I know that. I don't, I don't know how much that... That matters. If that's fair, but... There might be. No, you gotta type faster. Come on. <laughs> Just, oh, man. Um, you are a much better influence than, than the other two. You know, like, like, both, like, at least both, like, smart guys. Which, what Mike? I mean, Mike Slack? I mean, like, having beer in hand is great, but, like, I would drink, I would drink with Slack, and he would get wasted immediately. Like, we'd have, like, one beer, and he'd be hammered. Um, and, like, the year I lived with my buddy Jay, he was in his last year, and, like, he was, ha like, half his courses were computer programming, which he's brilliant at, and so, like, did not need to do it. Um, if, if you're talking about the Mike that dated Laura, I hated that guy, and I had no idea what his last name was. That guy was a prick. Crater's Melody is a piece of tripod. Man, I really gotta get, get in there. Mike Wells. Yep, that was it. Did not like him. Did not like him. He caused me and Anita to not talk for like three months. Because he was just not, I don't think, a good person. You may have your own opinion. You can you can feel about people how you want. I remember liking his roommate uh, Devin quite a bit. He, Devin was a good guy. Uh, he, yeah, yeah. I don't I don't want to get into it, you know, too much on live stuff. But like, he he kind of he kind of implied some things about about Jack, and was lying about them. Um, and like he said some stuff happened at an event that I was also at and then he also when I was seeing somebody kept hitting on her um, like like you know we just happened to run into each other to bar and he would not stop hitting on my girlfriend and kind of putting his hands on her and I was not having it. <clears throat> so and then he dated Laura for a bit, and was not, I don't think, that good a person. Um, so. Kind of my opinion. I remember liking his roommate a lot better, but uh, I need to thinking he was a pretty good guy, so I'm inviting him over all the time. But, like, she also had that other friend who was, like, in love with her, and she would invite over all the time. He was also not great. He was, he Thanks for watching. Please click to check out my other videos, like and subscribe, and come by Twitch under Floyd Mason to join my live streams.